Yo, what's going on, guys? Back with another Emblem video. In today's video, we got the new NBA Playoffs Conference Finals promo. We got the Master 97 Steve Nash. Yeah, we're going to be talking about how to get this Master quickly, how to get the points, the Masters. More Masters are going to be dropping. So, yeah, before we get into this video, make sure to drop a like, hit that subscribe button if you guys are new, have post notifications turned on. So, yeah, this promo does not have another master because of the bucks and nets game seven and also the sixers against the hawks game seven so once both of those games are done we're gonna be getting some masters added to this promo and i'll show you guys why we are there's proof as well so um yeah there's some 85 or 86 to 89 you turn them in get those points to get that grand master we also did end up getting a new nba grade 93 overall thurman I'm definitely going to be getting this car. He matches my chemistry, and I definitely need an upgrade to the center. But um, yeah, this promo is out for two weeks and four days. Let me know what you guys think of this promo. Obviously, there's not that many events. We only have one Grand Master. Let's check out the milestones. I already bought the coin pack, so that's why I have already 1,250 points. So yeah, let's check out these milestones. So at 2,000... You get four to eight conference finals tokens. We'll go over that. What you need them for. You get more playoff points. You guys are going to see how many points I've stacked up from the recent promos. But um, yeah, we get more points, more packs, more tokens. So once you reach 17,800, you get this token. So this token says, use this token in the conference finals master sets to select one out of four conference finals masters so we're gonna be getting four conference finals masters added probably on sunday morning or actually no probably sunday morning or monday morning because we are going to be getting a new promo on monday as well i'll drop a separate video talking about that promo but um yeah you guys can see we're going to be getting four masters and the grand master will be obviously the 97 steve nash so yeah, the milestones just get a bunch of repeater stuff, points, packs, tokens. So once you reach 70,000 points, you will end up getting the Steve Nash. This card is definitely going to be going on my bench. I'm going to keep Curry on the starting point guard. But um, yeah, this card is still nasty. You guys can see the stats. It has a 100 layup, 97 speed, 98 agility, 96 mid-range, 98 three-pointer, 101 passing accuracy, 100 court vision. This car is still nasty. Definitely worth grinding for this car. Later today, I'm also going to be dropping Grind to the Top Episode 6. Literally was grinding like crazy the last two hours before the new content update. And I came in clutch with that 94 Kyrie Irving. So yeah, we're going to be completing a bunch of masters, upgrading the team. So make sure you guys are on the lookout for that episode. Check out the playlist, all the episodes if you guys haven't already. But um, yeah, you got these events. You got 20 events. Each event you get 45 points and then you also get one out of three conference finals tokens. The other events you get four out of eight conference finals tokens. So you don't even get a chance at pulling a player out of these packs. So um, yeah, you guys already saw we're going to be getting more conference finals masters soon. So if you go over to the limited time events, go over to the playoffs hub. I have 24,700 points stacked up. The reason I do not want to spend them on these packs just because of the promo is going to be dropping on Monday. These points are probably going to be required for that. And I definitely want to have these points stacked up. But um, yeah, we'll be opening up these packs just to see what we end up getting. Because they didn't end up saying we're going to be getting 25 new players onto this conference finals promo. So they're obviously not going to be all high overall cards, but 25 players added to a promo is definitely insane. So yeah, I'm going to be opening up this player pack bundle. Let's see what we end up getting. Make sure to destroy the like button if you guys are not ready. So yeah, we get a 75 plus, then the last one is an 86 plus. So let's see what we get out of these packs. Okay, so we're just getting playoff players from the first round, second round probably. I don't like that that EA did that because in my grind to the top account, I was opening up the packs to complete the set where you turn in 
20 playoff players to get those 5,750 points. And I literally had like 6,000 playoff points. I was opening up the 75s to 84s. And I just kept pulling a bunch of first round players. So yeah, EA needs to update these packs. There's no way they're making us opening up these packs. We're not even guaranteed the players that we're looking for. But we got this 86 overall plus select pack. So let's see what players we get. Okay, so yeah, we're getting a bunch of playoff players. So yeah, you guys can see it's not worth it to open up this pack. We'll go with the 87 Jason Kidd. Why not? We're going to check if he can go on the set. I think he does. I think it doesn't matter. Because they did end up dropping an 89 overall Patrick Ewing. That it's like the Jason Kidd. You put him in whatever set. Counts as a player to get those points. So yeah, we're going to be getting new sets probably. New Masters as well. So these are the only two sets we got for the promo. Those Easter Conference tokens that you get from the milestones and also the events. Go over to this. You get the 75s to 85s. And you basically get those players and put them onto this set where you're turning 25 of these players and get 3,500 points. So I don't know if this set you can complete it right after the first one or there's a timer to it like 8 hours. So if you guys didn't end up completing this set, let me know how long the set refreshes or if you keep doing it repeatedly. But um, this promo right now is not looking too crazy just because we only ended up getting one master. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think of this promo. If you go over to the tab on the store, I open up all the coin packs, open up all the packs with the credits as well. So yeah, they also got this 90 overall Shaq and Rip Hamilton select pack. They should have made like a boomer bust pack for that pack. I would definitely would have dropped a pack opening to see if we could pull those players. But um, yeah, we're going to see in the next couple of days what we do end up getting added to this promo. So yeah, I don't think there's nothing else to talk about. I think that's basically it. You play the events, get the tokens, turn them into the players, put the players onto the set and get those points. And um, yeah, I'll say that it's still worth grinding for this card because probably a lot of people are not going to want to grind this promo. So less people are going to get this card. And that means once this card becomes auctionable, it's definitely going to go for a lot of coins because no one ended up grinding for it. So I definitely recommend you guys still grinding for these cards because you can still make coins out of getting those masters. So that's basically the promo. We're going to be opening up some packs. You guys can see I have 41 unclaimed items. I was going to drop a separate video like dropping variety pack openings with these packs. But I want to see if I do end up pulling some 88s and I'm able to complete another 94 master. So yeah, shout out to you if you guys are going to stay for the pack opening. Let's see what we end up getting. Some playoff players as well. They go onto the set. So these packs are still worth opening up. So we get 84 Drew Holiday. So we'll definitely take that. Any playoff player is definitely worth it. He goes on to the set, doesn't matter if it's first round, second round. As long as we do not pull any gold players, we'll take whatever we get. So we get Caruso out of that. Here we got Rondo. Okay, so we get a 77. So I'll open up a couple more. Probably gonna save the packs for some variety pack openings. So we'll open up like five more after this one. So these are the lightning wonder packs as well. So I'll just save the thunder packs for a variety pack opening. Because I've been getting okay, so we get an 85 volts right there. I've been getting prime packs from the daily login rewards and also the live pass. So yeah, definitely gonna save those for variety pack openings. So we get Shamit right there. Let's open up three more packs. Then we'll end it off. So yeah, so far we've been pulling playoff players, which is good. Those are the ones that we're looking for. So we get 88 Spreewell. Okay, we'll definitely take that. We got two more packs to go. We get our first gold player right there. So let's open up this last pack. Shout out to you if you guys made it this far into the video. I know these packs aren't the best. But hopefully you guys did have enjoying this video. Like the video. Subscribe if you guys are new. Have notifications turned on so you guys will never miss an upload. And um, yeah, let's see what we get for the last pack. 
we get an 83 gordon so let's go over to the set see if these players actually go into the set i think they do so you guys can see any player goes into the set doesn't matter if it's a playoff actually i was talking about hopefully we do not pull gold players out of the packs but you can actually put gold players playoff players molly master players lining for thunder players basically players as well kind of want to complete one of these sets so we can see if these cards or the set is repeatable so let's just do that Okay, so we're actually going to take out that Wagner that I did in the pudding. Did we get it back? I think we did. So let's claim these 3,500 points. See if this set is repeatable. You could definitely pick up the gold players from the auction house as well. I think they go for 1,500. If you can get 25, that's like 30K, 40K from gold players. And you get 3,500 points. So let's see if there's a timer on this. So there is a two hour or three hour cooldown. So yeah, that's not bad actually. So yeah, I might end up completing this. We could definitely get this master completed if you do end up completing the set. So yeah, we got some packs. So let's open up these packs. I was about to end off the video, but let's complete this. Open up these packs. Why not? Don't know how long the video is. Okay, so we get a Caruso. We got some tokens as well. We can put onto the set and get more packs. So yeah, this is basically fire. Not a bad promo, actually, now that these sets are able to be completed every three hours. So if we get 3,500 every three hours, we could definitely get a good amount of points in one day to get that 97 Nash, which I'm definitely hyped for. So we got, we got more packs. I wish these packs were like giving you a chance at least of like a 90 or something. Like 75 to 85 isn't the best. Okay, so we got an 84 Tobias Harris. We got some more conference finals tokens. So yeah, that's gonna be it for the video. If you guys didn't enjoy, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.